Okay, folks, listen, there's a bunch of other items in the world of movie news that we don't have time to go into in depth, but we want to make sure you're caught up to date with what's going on. So right now, this is a little something that we call the News Roundup. Another new poster for the upcoming Ben Stiller film, The Secret Life of Walter Mitty, has hit the web, showing the daydreaming main character riding the back of a shark. That sounds dangerous. <laughs> the Secret Life of Walter Mitty is based on James Thurber's classic story of a daydreamer who escapes his anonymous life by disappearing into a world of fantasies filled with heroism, romance, and action. When his job, along with that of his co-worker, are threatened, Walter takes action in the real world, embarking on a global journey that turns into an adventure more extraordinary than anything he could have ever imagined. The Secret Life of Walter Mitty hits theaters in December. One of the funniest comedies of this year is This is the End, and it will return to AMC theaters this week on September 6th for a limited time. The film made nearly $100 million domestically during its original run, and that was going up against Man of Steel. This is the End is written and directed by Evan Goldberg and Seth Rogen and stars Ro Rogen, Jay Burchell, James Franco, Craig Robinson, Danny McBride, and Jonah Hill, and I cannot wait. I want to see this again. So good. The Dinobots are coming! The Dinobots are coming! Transformers 4 hits AMC theaters on June 27th next summer, but we still don't have an official title for the film yet. There are reports that the studio has registered several domain names that include Transformers Last Stand, Transformers Apocalypse, Transformers Future Cast, and Transformers Age of Extinction. Also of note, Transformers producer Lorenzo de Buenaventura confirmed that the popular Dinobots will make their first appearance, yes, <laughs> but gave no details about how big or small of a part they would play in the story. As most of you know, the sequel to the classic comedy Dumb and Dumber is on the way and will be titled Dumb and Dumber 2. I love a good spelling error, by the <laughs> way, guys. Great title. However, it seems Jim Carrey and Jeff Daniels aren't the only cast members returning for the sequel. Brady Blum, the actor who played child Billy in 4C, the blind kid who Carrie and Daniel sold their dead bird to, is set to return as well. No word on an official release date yet for the film. Brilliant. Uh, film composer Hans Zimmer has reportedly been offered the job to score the upcoming Superman-Batman film, but hasn't yet decided if he's going to take the job. Zimmer also composed the scores for Christopher Nolan's Batman films and the recent Man of Steel. When asked about the project, Zimmer said the following, this is really complicated for me because we all went, okay, we're done with Batman, and now it's sort of getting smuggled back in. I'll have to have a think about this one. I might give you a new Batman if I do it. Oh, just do it. <laughs> Speaking of the upcoming Superman Batman movie, remember those reports that Breaking Bad star Brian Cranston had been given the role of Lex Luthor? Well, not only have several major outlets debunked the rumor, but now Cranston himself is denying the reports. The Superman Batman film will star the cast from Man of Steel and Ben Affleck as Batman and will hit AMC theaters in the summer of 2015. And that will do it for your news roundup.